Hello! Hey. I'm Dennis. I'm Andrew. We're, We're at the Crafty Lumberjacks, Lumberjacks and welcome to our big kitchen makeover reveal! Yes. Here it is! We went from this... ...to this! this. Most of you know we live in a one bedroom apartment in Astoria, Queens, New York. We've been here for about eight, nine years. Wow. But because we like to change out our space a lot for the holidays. space a lot for the holidays we haven't really done too much to the apartment we recently decided that we were going to stay here for a little bit longer because it's a rental we didn't want to invest too much money uh, we just wanted to make small changes that would have a big impact yeah and because our building is so old we were scared to touch the walls do anything to them but we're really glad we did these small changes really actually make us want to spend a lot of time in the kitchen <laughs> yes. and a lot less time in the other rooms in the apartment one thing we really didn't like about our kitchen was the amount of storage we were lacking. And we've always wanted to put shelves up here, but since the walls are plaster, we were really nervous to drill in them. But we took the chance and we're really happy we did. So we've started tackling the shelves and... It's in, not going too great. <laughs> no, it could be worse. We've it had could be worse. worse That's experiences, true. but... Yeah. Yeah, the wall is kind of crumbling, falling apart. It's curved. Uh, yeah, it's curved. It's not flat. Um, we're running into level issues and all these things, but we're we're still on, keeping on. Yeah, we <laughs> started this when the sun was out. And oh now my it's, gosh, it's dark. Oh, you're my helper, though. Really, really, really wanted to paint these cabinets, but since we're renters, we were not allowed. And what we did was stain the shelves to match the cabinets to give it a more cohesive look, and we really think it worked. Now, if you're gonna do open shelving, our tip is keep it minimal and keep it functional. The top shelf is mainly there for decoration and stuff we use every so often, and this bottom shelf are for essentials that we're gonna grab all the time. So we really didn't want to paint, so we decided to use adhesive peel and stick wallpaper for the walls. We're super happy we did because it looks awesome and it was super easy to put up. We also have a video and a blog post about our process. And of course we added the peel and stick tiles, which look super great, super cute. We got those at Home Depot. We're thinking of adding like a little trim here, but again, we don't want to bust our balls and we don't want to work too hard. You yeah, know, we want to keep it easy. We also painted our window green and added a new light fixture, which really made a big difference. Yes, everything kind of came to a standstill, as you know, um, but we're really happy with the progress we've made and the way it's been looking. We had uh, bigger plans and <laughs> bigger dreams to uh, get new blinds and fix the, the lighting treatment here. We still have like these cheap blinds yeah, that lines. were we so really over. Like. Yeah. Uh, we wanted to do the floor, the peel and stick floor tiles, but again, yeah. everything stopped. Yeah. Um, but we're really happy how it turned out. We want to tackle a few other rooms in our apartment. We hope you enjoyed our little kitchen tour. Yeah. And we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.